Hi. Hi, do you know why I'm here? Uh, is this an interview? I'm pretty sure. Hey, well come on in. Thanks. Did you just wake up? I did just wake up. You were asking. <laughs> The, those pants look comfy. Where'd you get them? Oh, I got them from Hollister. And thank you, Hollister, for sponsoring this video. Also, don't let me forget, I have something for you at the end of this video. It's a oh, special really? Surprise. I do, yes. Okay, I'm excited. Um, okay, well, what's the first thing you thought of today when you woke up? Answering the door. <laughs> um, what's the first thing on your to-do list? Uh, eat breakfast. What's your favorite thing to make in the kitchen? Usually I have sourdough bread. I actually just finished it, but I bake it like once a week. Sometimes I'll just put like a spread on it and that or a smoothie. Nice. What's your favorite thing to put on bread? You said a spread, but what? Uh, sometimes cream cheese. I like Nutella too. Um, anything with cheese, even though I shouldn't have it. <laughs> um, I've also heard that you make kombucha. I do make kombucha. Do you want to see it? Yeah. All right. It's up here. Uh, I try to keep away from my roommates because it's it's annoying. But you can see her back there. She's brewing right now. Wow. You probably don't care. But. Uh, well, it's interesting. <laughs> um. Okay. Well, speaking of kombucha, can you do your best kombucha girl impression? Oh. That one. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The Britney Broski. Well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one. Cool. Um. So kombucha is pretty sour. Would you say that you have an obsession with sour things? I wouldn't say obsession. I just have an affinity for it. <laughs> you want to come to the living room right now? Sure. As you can see, we've decorated for the holidays. <laughs> and... Wow, who is that? Uh, that's you. You're the co-host. And that's me. This is our podcast, Top and Bottom, now available on Apple and Spotify. Amazing. I like that Christmas tree. Thank you. She's a skinny legend. She is. And she costs only $40. <laughs> Um, so Christmas is coming up. What's your favorite thing about the holidays? Presents, definitely. Giving presents, <laughs> receiving presents, anything about, anything about opening things. That's a pretty big beanbag chair. Where'd you get it? I got it from Amazon. Wow. How did you bring that in the apartment? Uh, it was compressed and then I opened it up and then 10 minutes later it just plopped out like this, but it was yay big. Wow. <laughs> How often do you think that like a week you're just in that chair? Um, I'd say like at least once every day. <laughs> this is like my spot in the room. Yeah, that's true. I'm speaking from experience. Mm -hmm. um, so what shows have you been binging lately? The Good Place. Oh, that's a good yeah, one. I really like it. Who's your favorite character from the show? Definitely Eleanor. I feel like I would be her in that situation. <laughs> um, well, speaking of the show, what is the most recent good thing you've done? Letting into my house. Okay, um, this is my house. So <laughs> um, what about a bad thing? Letting you back into my house. Mm -hmm, okay. Um, how do you like living in Brooklyn? I love it. It's really cozy. Um, I always like New York more than anywhere else, so no complaints. <laughs> well, you're complaining this morning with all the banging going on outside. There was a lot of construction, but that's, <laughs> that's the atmosphere. Um, this might be controversial, but Brooklyn or Manhattan? I'd say Brooklyn for living, Manhattan for having fun. Okay, well, you look like you're being absorbed in yellow. Would you say it's your favorite oh. color? Well, yeah, it is. Um, and speaking of yellow, let me just like give you even more. <laughs> so give me one second. Okay. How do I look? Oh my gosh, you're <laughs> radiating yellow. Where'd you get that Thank outfit you. from? I got it from Hollister. And once again, this video is sponsored by Hollister. Thank you. But this year they are doing a Hollister Feel Lab. It's a gift giving lab centered around the feeling you want to give. So this makes me feel happy, vibrant, radiating, joyful. <laughs> that other outfit right underneath this made me feel cozy. And that's why I did not want to open the door today. <laughs> and just in general, Hollister is the perfect place to give gifts this year. So if you want to check them out, the link is in the description. Thank you, Hollister, for sponsoring this video. Would you like to come in? Sure. Oh, wow. So this is my humble abode where I sleep. Which desk is yours? Well, I think it's kind of obvious. <laughs> I like it. So, I heard you have quite the jewelry collection. Can I see? I do. Yeah, it's in this box. I got it recently. And there's like bracelets, there's earrings, there's Cute. rings. Oh, so there's necklaces of all kinds. <laughs> um, what's your favorite piece? Uh, obviously, the lemon one is up there. So like this one. <laughs> and these green ones are also there. Just anything that dangles, honestly. So this is your desk. Is this where all the magic happens when behind the camera? It is. I film here usually, I edit here all the time, and I, I can be here for hours every day. Wow. Do you like filming or editing more? I think I like editing more. It's because like I don't have to be physically active. I can just sit here and lie back. <laughs> okay, I don't actually know this, but how old were you when you were, when you started YouTube? I started in my freshman year, so like 14 years old, 13. Wow. If you weren't a YouTuber, what else would you do with your time? Probably photography or gaming. You know, I enjoyed that a lot. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so photography and gaming. What are your other favorite hobbies? Uh, plant shopping is 
recently a new one. <laughs> yes, I know. It's grown a lot. <laughs> What's the last thing you purchased? I think it was a plant. Really? <laughs> I think it was this plant. Um, okay, well, what do you want to do in the future? Uh, obviously, I want to keep doing YouTube, but I'm getting a degree in digital media for a reason, so maybe something in graphic design. I would love to do photography, but anything artistic. Or mm -hmm. make a plant nursery. Cute. Yeah. So you don't have this room all to yourself. Who's your roommate? My roommate is Emma. She's not here right now, but we are just best friends because we vibe together. We have the same Cute. interests. How'd you guys meet? Last year, they're mutual friends, I think. Cute. Um, so I see the plants. You do. Can you tell me more about them? Well, most of these I got from um, just like secondhand. I try not to go purchase them when they're like over $20 because I do want to save some money. <laughs> I know that's very hypocritical. I just like the idea of giving gifts to myself. So like this is a Monstera Deliciosa. It's a rosemary plant, skin dapped. You don't care. <laughs> okay, uh, tough question. Which one's your favorite? Don't make me do that. There's no, no, no. You have to have a favorite. There's no favorite. Okay, which one's your least favorite? Oh, least favorite, I'd say, is this one right now because it's giving me a lot of trouble. She's being very dramatic. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, how did you get interested in plants? I think I saw Jenna Marvel's video and then it just like sparked something inside of me. And then I just, ever since then, have been collecting and it's been growing every day. Yeah. This is a little personal, but I know your mom has a garden. Do you think that had a little influence on you? Oh, I am like my mom. <laughs> okay, cute. Um, so, would you ever consider being a botanist? Definitely. <laughs> if, if I could just live as a botanist, 100%. All right, I have to ask, mm -hmm. where do you sleep in this room? Where do you think? <laughs> yeah, what's wrong with it? Uh, nothing's wrong with it, I was just wondering. Um, how do you like sleeping there? I like it. Most people don't. Some people are very judgmental of it, but mm -hmm. personally, it helps with my back because I edit so much, I start getting like the shrimp back. Mm -hmm. Um, has anyone ever told you that you sleep under Emma's bed like a troll under a bridge? You. Mm -hmm. um, okay, seriously though, on a scale of 1 to 10, how would you recommend the, the mat you have? I'll, I'll say 8 if you don't mind sleeping on the floor, but if you need like an actual mattress, 0. <laughs> okay. Um, so behind you, yeah. uh, what are those? Are they stuffed animals? Yeah, there's some stuffed animals. So like, I cuddle with this one, I have a lot of yellow ones too, like this one too. <laughs> Yeah, they're just like my little other family. Cute. So, does your boyfriend care that you still sleep with these stuffed animals? Maybe. Speaking of boyfriend, I actually have a date that I'm gonna be late for, so I'm gonna have to kick you out one more time so I can just change. Oh, okay. Yeah, so just oh, scooch, yeah. scooch. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Wow, I love your outfit. Thank you. You think my boyfriend will like it? I know he'll like it. Okay, good. Um, well, what style advice can you give to people who maybe aren't so style, style savvy? Uh, I'd say try to shop for your body type. So like, I'm a little more petite, so things that are like boots or big pants don't work for me. Mm -hmm. um, what's a trend? Oh, I guess you just told me, but maybe more specifically, what's a trend you know you can't pull off? Boots. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> okay well, before I go, um, do you mind if I ask you some speed round questions? You promise it'll be fast? Yes. Okay, yeah, come on back in. Question number one, where did you get that chair? This chair was from you. Mm -hmm. And you gave me this chair because Emma found another chair that was in the trash room. <laughs> <laughs> and then I took Emma's chair, and yeah. then you took my chair. Yeah, and then my chair's back at home. Chairs for everybody. Yep. <laughs> what makes you happy? Um, <laughs> this is shallow, but receiving gifts. But I guess, like, in general, obviously my friends, family, having a home under my head. Uh, oh, oh, that's not how you say it. <laughs> having a roof over my head. That's okay. Okay, cool. Um, when's the last time you cried? Was it last week? I think it was last week from like some TikTok that was like about cats. Oh. Um, what's your favorite movie? Devil Wars Prada. Devil Wars Prada. Um, what's your favorite animal? Cats. Or the orca. <laughs> uh, who's your favorite artist? Conan Gray. Um, what's your favorite scent? Scent? Sandalwood or lemons. Okay. Um, have you ever committed a crime? Be honest. I plead the pit. The <laughs> <laughs> I play the fit. Okay. Um, do you have any scars on your body? I have this one right here because when I first learned how to walk, I ran into a desk. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, are you a good dancer? Absolutely not. <laughs> you are. I know I am. Okay. Um, what's your favorite McDonald's menu item? Big Mac. <laughs> one or two? Two. <laughs> what superpower would you want? 
uh, to be invisible. Oh. Why? I don't know. She like that one's. It's not. That's a more inverted. Whoa. Introverted, inverted. Okay, whatever. Um. Okay. What's the best place you've ever traveled to? Hawaii. Nice. Or somewhere you want to travel to? Japan. What would your What would your autobiography be titled? Everything that went wrong. Okay. <laughs> What's the best advice you've ever been given? Always be yourself, no matter how many people judge you, because there's always a place for you in the world. Cute. All right, well, I guess I have to go, but you did say I had a gift. That's it? We're done? Well, unless you want me to stay. Oh, no, 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 I'm gonna be late. <laughs> I do have a gift for you, come this way. It's by the Christmas tree. Oh, cute. So, I know it's the gift giving season, and this may be a little bit early, but Hollister wanted me to give you a little pair of clothes for you. Because awesome. I think you need to up your style a little okay. bit. Okay, well, thank you of for that. <laughs> Um, so should I see my way out or? Yes, you should see your way out. Okay, well, um, thank you so much for having me. Of course. I love spending time with you. Thank you. Um, I'll be back soon. All right. Toodles. <laughs> okay, I actually live here, so I need to come back. Yeah. <laughs> thank you once again, Hollister, for sponsoring this video.